Hello everyone, it's Kene Chukutele from Light Peeps Academy. Let me show you how to make use of your MT5, okay? Um, if you look here, if you open your MT5 for the first time, you might be seeing this. This is what you might see. So, this is just the code. Here you see different currency pairs. I believe you've heard about currency pairs. So, you just have different currency pairs here. Then, uh... Here we have the bid price and the ask price. So these ones here, these ones here are the bid price, this one the ask price. And if you move over to this side, if you click there, that's where you see the charts. You see charts. Then if you want to check another pair, this USD JPY. In 15 minutes if you want to go to a higher time frame you click you click anywhere you touch anywhere you go to one hour time frame and you see it you can zoom in you can zoom out then if you want to go to another pair just click here to select another pair you click and then this euro usd gbp any of the pair you want to check it let's check this one you just click on it and you see it to show you can zoom in or zoom out anything you want to do then you can go to so if you this one here this one here is called the crosshair cursor if you click i will still tell you how to make use of the crosshair cursor you can locate a particular price this one's here are the price this thing here is the price of the markets at, the, at a particular point in time this market now this is the price at this point of this video this is the price it's at this price so you can use the cross circuit to locate a particular price you want to do anything with i'll still tell you how to where to make use of your cross circuit so then here you have um here you have indicators that f sign when you click it you move over you see indicators moving average and the rest don't worry when the time comes i'll show you how to add different indicators and how to make use of indicators in your trading these ones here are called candlestick if you zoom in this one's here the red one and the green one yours might be white and uh, black but here i have it red and green the red ones are the bear the bearish one the green one are the bullish candles and i hope you know what bullish and bearish means so here if you go over to this place if you want to have monitor two particular pairs two pairs that's when you make use of this place you add a new window let's say yeah euro usd this one is euro jpy you can change any of them and then you let's say uh usd jpy for this one then you have it this way so you can monitor these two trades at once as you mean you are monitoring this one and you want to also monitor this one you can put the two of them and monitor it at once so let's delete the other one and make use of the one we are and just make use of one and so this is where to place your order like i've thought before in the previous video where to place your order after your analysis you click there and then you can place so that this is the lot size you can reduce the lot size to the least lot size so that you can only use a big lot size depending on your depending on your account size then here is where you put your stop loss and here is where you put your take profit i'll still talk about stop loss and take profit later after your after setting every other thing if you want to place a buy or a sell you you come over here this is the buy button and this is the sell button you can click any of them you buy or you sell then you go back then let's say let's go to the quote okay not the quote we've done the quote if you have any okay this we are at the chat then we move to the next uh, uh button there which is this one when you click on it you see your running trades this one i placed it ahead of price this one is running already in case i tell you to modify a trade this is how to modify a trade you just click on it hold it and you see modify position you can modify the position here click on it you can assuming you've placed the trade you can now put your stop loss and take profits 
that's how to modify a trade and then let's go if this is where you see all the positions you have and the, okay talking about the balance and the equity this is the balance in this account and this is the equity this the equity is a bonus there's a bonus there though this is the equity so the balance the equity is addition of the balance and whatever thing you have here that will be your equity but never mind this one you want to understand this one so just knowing that balance is whatever you have here at i mean the equity is whatever you have here and what you have here so at this particular point the, the blue shows that it's in profit the trade i place here is in profit if it's showing red you'll be seeing minus at the back which will be reading here and then it will be minus from the balance and you'll be showing you your equity and then the next uh, this one is where you okay you can just navigate through and then you can check these ones by yourself then this place let me click here sorry I click there and you click here you can manage account that's if you want to add a demo or real account to your mt5 you click there but i'll still show you how to create a demo or real account okay there's something i'm forgetting uh if you want to edit the this pairs here or if you want to add pairs assuming you open your chart assuming you open your chart here and you open here and you're not seeing all these currency pairs this is what you just do just go to this place no sorry go to your quotes click on this cross sign click there when you click on it you see forex you will see forex major you see forex minor you just click on forex major add all the forex everything you see there click on forex minor add everything you see there i've added everything in my own so I, it has disappeared i can't I, you can't find it here again but let's let me just use this one as an example let me say um, i want to add this particular pair so that i'll be seeing it in my chart let's say a euro south african run i click on it it has added to the pk the kk it has added now let's go back to the chart and then you see these ones i added now as you can see here they are sorry sorry this one's taking some time to shift here yeah. as you can see here they are sorry here it's over there and if you shift down you still see this one here you can see it it has added then if you want to delete anyone still go back to the same place click there oh, i'm sorry not on the cross again click on this edit button when you click on the edit button then you click on the delete button the delete uh, symbol there you come down click on it click on anyone you want to delete and you delete it and then it's gone you go back to your chart if you click there you will see it again that's just it so that is all you need to know about how to use your mt5 for now there are still other things you learn at the course of your study but for now just know those ones